Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a review of my new Clemence wallet by Louis Vuitton. So if you're curious to know everything about it and if I recommend it, keep on watching. Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing super super good. If you're new here, subscribe to my channel. It's the red button below. It's 100% free and means a lot to me. Um, basically today is a very interesting and fun video for me to film because I've been really wanting to film this review for a while. As you can see, this is the first thing I'm gonna address to you guys because you've probably been around my channel and if you haven't, do subscribe. But if you have, you've probably seen my previous video and the one before. Um, I'm actually in the process of moving. Um, today is actually beginning of September, the 6th of September to be exact, and I'm still not moved in yet. Um, if you want to know all about the drama of my move and what has gone wrong, what has gone right, all that stuff, do watch my previous vlog that I will link around the screen or stay tuned and subscribe because in about two to three weeks you will have the second episode of my move and this is where a lot of things go down you will know everything but anyways i really wanted to film this video because you know it's important for me to keep on posting whenever um, i can and i love posting every thursday and it's not because i'm moving that i don't want to post so i took the advantage today of the nice weather and of my parents place you know this is my old room as you can see i'm sitting on the chair that is not mine it doesn't match my aesthetic uh, there's a lot of things behind that don't exist anymore because obviously Obviously, most of my furniture is in the new apartment but I really wanted to film this video so basically all this to say it's absolutely normal if it's echoey if it's different and all that stuff but don't worry um, in about one or two videos you will definitely see the background of my new apartment I'm gonna talk about this particular wallet today that I got at the Capri store uh, the Louis Vuitton Capri store um, as you guys probably know I actually have a vlog on my channel about everything related to my trip this summer. I actually went about a month or so ago to Sorrento, Capri, Positano and Naples and I filmed it all. It's a very long vlog on my channel but it's worth it if you want to go there or if you're curious to know what I did there. And I notably filmed the whole process of me buying this particular wallet. I also filmed an unboxing so if you want to see a bit more related to the packaging or you know how I felt buying it or when I opened it, all that stuff, do Go check out the vlog because there's that little part in it. But today I'm going to talk about this particular wallet that I've been using for about a month now so you know I really wanted to film the quick unboxing in the vlog and talk about it to you guys today. So I guess let's get going with the material, the characteristics, what you can fit in it and what I think about it right now. I actually own a few leather goods from Louis Vuitton and I actually love the quality of the leather goods. I've never been disappointed and I know a lot of my friends who absolutely love the quality of the leather goods by the brand Louis Vuitton so obviously for me it was normal to get a wallet by this brand. Also another thing that is quite important and I like to mention it on my channel because I'm transparent with you guys, um, luxury brands tend to be very expensive. So if we talk Dior, Chanel, Hermes, they're all super expensive brands and it's just impossible to get a wallet by them because it can even reach up to like a thousand euros or dollars whatever for wallets. So it can be very pricey and I feel like it's such a pity because everybody deserves to just have a little something um, that is, you know, luxury. So I love Louis Vuitton because they have normal prices if I can say so for luxury brands like it's not over the top either so that's why I really wanted to get a wallet by them because I also know it's gonna stay for so many years with me but basically this wallet comes in different um options if I can say so you obviously can find this wallet in the zippy I think it's zippy wallet or something like that the one I actually have which is half the size perfect to put in a little clutch it also comes in a bigger size than this one which is actually the one that I first saw in the store but it's incredibly big I feel like and what is funny is that Louis Vuitton actually says you can use it as a clutch so that's why I felt like it was a little bit too big I don't want to have it as a clutch it was just as a wallet and I think that the bigger version has like two like one more compartment in here instead of just having I believe one separation it has two um don't quote me on that because i don't really remember but it is 
significantly bigger and also pricier obviously i think it's 200 euro more anyways i decided to go for this one because this is exactly the type of size i like to have for my wallet it fits in any of my bags except if it's a small bag or you know obviously if i'm taking like a mini bag it won't fit it's extremely pretty so as you can see mine is in the damier azure canva and i'm so happy that i finally got my hands on a damier azure canva version if i can say so because i already have two monogram the zippy and the speedy bag uh, like the little wallet and the speedy bag and i have also the damier eben for the mini pochette accessoire but i never got my hands yet on damier azure and as you can see this is super girly um, i love white i love cream so if you're a girly girl i really recommend the damier azure canva but this particular wallet does come in damier men and monogram and what is amazing about this wallet is the little accents of color because this is what sold me on it more than the Demi Azure is the actual color they chose for the little uh, parts that you use to um, zip your wallet and also for the insides as you can see it's all pink this is actually the pink ballerina color or rose ballerine in French basically for the Demi Azure version you only have the option of having the inside in pink if I'm not wrong but I checked online just before and that was the case but for the Demi Ben and the monogram you can also have it cherry basically so it means that this little part right here and the inside is going to be a cherry color similar to the inside of my mini pochette accessoire one so yeah so that's the little differences so it's really nice because you can really pick and choose what you prefer in the inside what you prefer in the outside uh the only downside if you prefer cherry for the inside the color cherry inside um is that i don't believe it comes with the demi azure canva but uh, this is what I've seen today on the online store, but maybe it does exist, I don't know, in boutiques. I really have no clue about that, but this is what you can find online. So for the material, as I explained just before, this is going to be all Canva and the lining is leather. So it's a very good quality. Um, Louis Vuitton is well known to, you know, create really strong leather goods. They did start with the idea of creating pieces to travel with like suitcases bags and things like this so obviously they are definitely amazing at creating pieces that will stay for a long time and they are super sturdy strong durable so this is why i really recommend going for the small leather goods at louis vuitton because they are such good quality and obviously i'm not sponsored i wish i wish honestly Honestly, with you guys, I wish Louis Vuitton could sponsor me and send me products. Anyways, for now, no, it's not the case. I'm just gonna talk honestly with you guys about this wallet. So these are the options. The gold hardware all around it is stunning. Um, I actually love gold hardware around this one. I think it ties the pink and the creamy color super well with a bit of this gray accent all around it. I really, really, really love the style. And now if I talk a bit about the space in the wallet, because this is probably going to be also very important for you. Inside you have a little pocket right here in which you can put coins. So you open it and you have coins in there. I, I love everything. I'm really hoping the close-ups show it well enough because it's really hard for me to show you exactly what it looks like. And you have space for eight cards in total around here and around here. You have four and four. And you do have a little space at the back right here. Um, I'm gonna try to show it to you like this. Here we go. Like you have a little pocket right here at the back and in here I tend to put business cards, little papers or cards that don't fit in the card uh, area because if you have more than eight cards, it might be tricky. So I would go for the bigger wallet or I would just put my cards at the back like I did. So I'm extremely happy with the material, with the style of it, with everything. I'm just loving it and it's the perfect color and style for a girly girl. I'm repeating myself, but to be honest, if you're searching for high quality and pretty wallet, Louis Vuitton has your heart i'm sure of it because it's it's just it's stunning i love it and this is that you obviously have the little louis vuitton uh, logo right here and i forgot to mention but at the inside you do have the stamp you can't really see it well perhaps but it's written louis vuitton paris made in spain which is normal don't panic um some leather goods are made in italy and in spain not just in france don't panic in case you see this it is a real uh, louis vuitton wallet but uh just a little parenthesis i'm giving you the price i paid in the boutique in italy and it actually is the same price 
as the online shop for France in Italy. So like this, you have an idea. And this particular one, the one I have, retails for 390 euros. And the bigger version is 570. So it's significantly um, higher price. And now I'd like to just quickly finish the video with my own kind of thoughts about it. Like, is it actually easy to wear? Is it easy? Is it useful? Um, all that good stuff, I really want to mention it to you guys. So I've been using this wallet for the past month now. Um, yeah, the past month. So I always take it like every single day to work because I have a big work bag. So I always put this wallet in the bag. And I've also tried to, you know, use it as much as I can. I don't think I've used any other wallet for the past month. Um, and I wanted to quickly give you like the pros and the cons of getting this wallet. To be honest, most of them are pros. I am actually very happy with the wallet. I do see that the quality is there. I mean, that's something I expected. I tell you like the other leather goods I have from Louis Vuitton, they're all looking still brand new after six, seven years. So I had no doubt about the quality. Um, this is why I don't really hesitate too much for the price in that situation because it's something I'll keep and something I just I can really say the quality is there so quality wise no problem so far it's perfect it zips very nice there's no issues with anything um, it's made extremely well style wise I mean I love the style I love the color it matches everything I wear it matches my bag um, obviously for someone like me who loves l colors like this and pink and everything it's obviously the perfect choice i wouldn't have imagined myself getting the monogram or the demi ben i think this one matches everything much better um the only thing i would say that is possibly a con um well there's two things one is in fact the space for the cards um in my case it's not too much of an issue as of now because i don't have many cards so i don't need more space and i don't really care about putting them in the little back pocket to me it's fine to put it in the back pocket but it could be a downside and a con for some people for sure i'm a bit scared about one thing though and that's another con of this particular wallet and it's the color i know that i really wanted this color so i don't want to regret it um and i don't regret it ever i wouldn't ever regret that color i love it but um thank god it's cream and not white because i thought for the longest time i don't know why probably because online it looks super white but i thought it was white the color but it's actually cream which is much easier to just throw into any bag because you don't you're not as scared of this as if it was like really a white one but i'm still very scared of like i don't know having a pen open in my bag and having it like stain it but so far no problem and i'm trying to be as careful as i can but otherwise really there's no other cons i really recommend this one if you're searching for a new wallet you want to change yours you want to get a really good quality one a very pretty one I really recommend this one. So to me, it's really, I will say a 9 out of 10 for the Clemence Wallet by Louis Vuitton. Okay guys, so we're at the end of the uh, review. I tried my best to explain everything. I always forget things, so if you have questions, do pop them below in the comments below. Let me know if you have this wallet or if you want to get it or which wallet do you actually have at the moment. Obviously, you don't need Louis Vuitton. Uh, if you need a wallet, you can totally find any other wallet that will do the job. But I really wanted to treat myself on my birthday as well to this one and I'm very happy with the quality of it. So if you're debating getting a Louis Vuitton or not, I would recommend getting a Louis Vuitton, of course. So that's pretty much it for today's video. Um, I really hope you enjoyed. And as I always say, I will see you next week in my next video. Bye everyone.